This amendment is the product of more than a year of working collaboratively with both the patient and provider coalition and the insurance industry, both of which have spent countless hours to provide input to this amendment. This amendment would do several things. It creates a new, more effective process for prior authorization review that keeps everything consistent and transparent from start to finish. It updates timelines for stages of review and ensures that all denials are made by properly licensed medical professionals in the same or similar specialty. Additionally, the underlying bill only applies to managed care plans, which are Medicaid managed care organizations and gatekeeper commercial insurance plans. This amendment would expand applicability to Medicaid, the Children's Health Insurance Program, known as CHIP, and fully insured commercial plans. The amendment also requires insurers to establish a provider portal for electronic submission, which will streamline the process and make submissions more efficient. The amendment requires the insurer to make all medical policies and clinical review criteria available on their publicly accessible website or portal, creating transparency on how insurers base their decisions. Additionally, the amendment streamlines the existing two levels of internal compliant and internal grievance review into a single review. Finally, it makes significant changes to step therapy procedures, including aligning step therapy and prior authorization reviews so that the processes are similar. Mr. President, I respectfully ask my colleagues to cast an affirmative vote for this amendment to Senate Bill 225. Thank you, Mr. President.